Okay, so here's the thing. I have an Apple Watch and, you know, I've got a love-hate relationship with it because I don't like wearing watches, but at the same time, I like the fact that it's checking my heart rate, it's checking my fitness, my movements and stuff throughout the day to get me motivated to keep moving and stuff like that. But I, I'm not a fan of wearing watches. I don't like banging my wrist on something and thinking the watch is gonna be broken and things like that. Let's talk about the Apple Ring. Hey, this is Scott Weinkiff with a storyteller with a camera talking about all the things photographers like you and I are thinking about. And in this video, I'm talking about something completely unrelated to photography, sort of. Photographers do use Apple Watches. They do think about fitness, but that's not really what I'm talking about. It's 2021 and sensors are getting smaller. Technology is getting better. Companies are getting smarter. People are getting smarter. And I think that with the success that Aura Ring is seeing, we're gonna see some really cool innovations in smart wearables in 2021, 2022. And I'm hoping that this concept I'm about to talk about with an Apple Ring will happen. Maybe this is something that Apple will do, maybe they won't do, maybe Aura Ring will see this and they'll think about doing this, but here is what I'm thinking. The first part of an Apple ring would be that it is silicon based. It is not a metal ring. It is silicone based, just like any sports ring you might get so that if you go to the gym or you're doing martial arts or you're playing baseball or whatever, it's flexible, it doesn't impact anything. You can actually do activities while wearing the ring and not risk hurting yourself, hurting somebody, somebody else or anything like that. So silicone is way better for fitness and daily activities over a metal ring. Now here's the thing. You might think, can you fit electronics in silicone? Well, you can. Companies are doing it. This would have sensors inside of the band, just like the Aura Ring does, except the Aura Ring is metal. There's no screen on this ring. You don't need a screen. 99% of what this ring does is controlled through your phone, the Apple Ring app. There will be a 12 day or 14 day charge with a similar charging dock to what the Aura Ring has, which is sort of like, it looks like a finger that you just sort of sit the ring on there and it charges. This ring will have a heart rate sensor, sleep tracking, temperature sensor, movement sensor for motion, for walking, for fitness, for if you fall. And of course, if there's enough room, if the chips can get small enough, a GPS. Wouldn't that be nice? especially for the photographers. Now, this would also have different fitness modes. If it, You can set it to a run workout, you can set it to a walk workout, a cycling workout, a martial arts punching the heavy bag workout, because again, this is silicone. In theory, you can still wear boxing gloves and stuff like that while you're wearing the ring. Now, there will be a soft button on this ring, and that soft button has one purpose. Its purpose is to initiate or activate a workout. And that workout, you actually specify the default button workout in the Apple Ring app. And it's like one of those little soft tactile buttons that uh, you've seen in silicone products before. Of course, 2021 Apple Fitness Plus is out, which currently it requires an Apple Watch in order to use, but the Apple Ring will also be supported. Why not? Now here's the most important thing I think of them all is that because this is a fully enclosed wireless silicone system with no screens and no ports, this ring is 100% waterproof and very durable to take any abuse thrown its way. You wanna be able to work out with it, but then also hop in the pool or jump in the shower or whatever it is you need to do. So that's my idea for the Apple Ring. I'd love to see if you have any thoughts of what Apple should do with the Apple Ring when they finally get to it. You know they're thinking about it. You know they're working on it already. I mean, it's 2021. It would be more comfortable than a watch, in my opinion. Comment down below. Let me know what you think Apple should do in the Apple Ring. Don't forget to subscribe.